So, uh, from the point of view of the uh, of the European Commission, we invest uh, quite a number of uh, funds in international uh, research networks, and the scope is <clears throat> to get a better policy dialogue with uh, different regions in the world. If I take the example of the Mediterranean and the uh, wider Balkan area, I think that over time, at least the last few years, we've seen a very good level of engagement of both the uh, local scientists and the policy makers. And that's exactly um, the principle of our uh, operation, which falls within our international cooperation program which in itself is also a basis for general cooperation agreements which are uh, operated at the level of the Commission itself. Basically, what the, uh, what the networks uh, aim to uh, achieve is a form of capacity building, which gives a good platform for the uh, local scientists, scientific community to get better involved with their European counterparts, and that also gives them a better access to the thematic areas of the framework program and hence to more funding for their own proposals in the future. So all in all I would say that uh, from the perspective of the European Commission these networks are very useful, they're still under development, they are expanding and they will try to cover more areas than they did in the past. Thank you.